Hi, my name is Corey Parkin. Um, I'm a proud uh, Ganyagahaga artist from Mohawk Sabaya Quinney, located on the Tainanaga Mohawk territory. So kind of going back to this, I was like really brainstorming between like some, one of the original Toronto Rock with the CN Tower and playing like the uh, lacrosse deck, like the guitar there. So that's why I kind of wanted to do, rather than like the CN Tower, but kind of do like a person with a stick instead uh, there. Um, lacrosse being the national summer sport of Canada that I really wanted to showcase like the, it does in the Toronto Rock logo the maple leaf kind of in the background. The, in the indigenous culture, the circle is an important symbol that's just done for, represents like gathering places and like circles of life and stuff and balance and all that. So I use the six circles in the maple leaf as well to kind of tie into the titles as well. And then just also like the like key things in my art that I always want to kind of showcase me being Mohawk as well. So the three feathers on top, the three eagle feathers represents a Mohawk on Augusta ways. Uh, then also having the words of uh, Begaranto for Toronto, which translates to the place in the water where the trees are standing. And then the Deoranto, which translates for lacrosse to the, it has dual nets. So just those little kind of key things in to also showcase and tell a story about my culture as well. Um, so that's why with, I wanted to include like the turtle shell to represent the turtle island. And then just kind of as being like, since uh, lacrosse was a gift given to us through the creator, just having the players on top of the Turtle Island kind of playing in there that's inside the, the rock logo as well. It was also played through the indigenous um, people as being like a way to kind of train and prepare themselves for combat and that. So it was me just kind of making the player on top, kind of also like looking as like being a warrior. The history behind like the wooden stick and that. And also I, I felt like when me doing this partnership with the team as well, it like it'd be an indigenous heritage night there. That's why I kind of also wanted to tie in like more rather than like a modern look, but more like the heritage kind of where the kind of like the sport kind of started from. Yeah, I've just an uh, artist that has been uh, kind of getting into a lot of like the sports redesign um, and just wanting to be proud of my indigenous culture. I've always just looked to want to find ways to not only showcase the sports that I grew up uh, admiring and playing, but also just finding a way to kind of like promote my indigenous culture.